Hello, Kafa Day 303. So, I was trying to uh, get fine tuning working uh, using Hugging Face Transformers, and it is for GPT 2. And I got it to figure out uh, by reducing the batch size. The problem is it takes so much longer than GPT Simple and I have no idea how. Um, so, you know, for the new data sets uh, with the size of about 100 megabyte, 140 megabyte, it would take, I don't know, eight days. Uh, and that's just for medium sized uh, pre trained data sets. Uh, pre-trained model and you know who knows how long it would take with extra large um, the problem is it it crashes too easily uh, it runs with only like maybe full batch size and I don't know what the difference was uh, difference was GPT simple because I could easily set it up up to maybe you know 32 batch size there and it runs fine um, you know it, it, it uses RAM uh, to almost max out uh, in this case with hugging face transformers like it seems like it's not utilizing the RAM uh, that much um, it stays around maybe you know 2 gigabyte and yeah it's not changing that much but it still crashes if I increase the size so I'm not sure what the difference is so I don't know it might be because you know one is based on PyTorch uh, and the other on uh, TensorFlow or yeah the other one is not utilizing all the GPU or I'm not sure I need to tweak uh, but I think I'm just gonna do I'm just gonna uh, test the test the difference with small data sets um, between the two and if the GPT simple runs as fine then I'll just keep it that yeah I didn't know GPT simple was that much more convenient to run it and train train it uh, it works so much better yeah so I have no idea um, yeah that's about that and I finished integrating uh, the summarization, summarization extension uh, was a hood suit as well as hood suit and which else did I integrate it with? I forgot which one actually. Uh, maybe I think there was one more. Anyway, so that is it. So see you. Bye.